This year marks one century since the Armenian genocide. In remembrance of the survivors of that Holocaust, the Aurora Prize was created, where a humanitarian is chosen and presented $1 million. The first, the very first recipient of the Aurora Prize for Awakening Humanity is going to go to Marguerite. A humanitarian from Burundi named Marguerite Barankitsa won the inaugural prize. Burundi, next to Rwanda and Tanzania, underwent a horrific civil war in the 1990s. Maggie survived the violence and started Maison Shalom, an organization that rescues war orphans in the region. She was at the UN's Social Good Summit just last month, where we had the chance to hear her story. Everybody call me Maggie. Uh, I am the founder and the president of Maison Shalom in Burundi. Welcome, Maggie. I create Maison Shalom in 1993 after watching massacres. I lost more than 60% of my family. I left my village and I went to hide my seven children that I adopted. I watched they killed 72 friends, two persons that I love so much. I decided to die or I can leave my country. Maison Shalom is a message to say to everybody we can continue to love, and love always take the last word. I can tell you why now I am refugee. This president began to, uh, to kill, to torture, to put in a prison, in jail. And I went to, uh, to tell him that I am not agree with him. You can't uh, go against the, uh, my mission and I can't keep silence. Then they tried to kill me. Then I was obliged to free the country. You can't imagine that what I suffer in those refugee camps, the young teenagers who were raped and who were uh, tortured, they put plastic, they put fire, and they burn them in genital. of the Aurora Prize for Awakening Humanity is going to go to Marguerite. When I got the Aurora Prize, it was like a message to tell me, go on, never give up, I am with you. For me, it was like a call from God to say, it's not your job, Maggie. It's my job. Aurora Prize was like a consolation. It, it was like to, to say to all those Burundian people who are suffering, we, I am with you. We are one human family. We are brothers and sisters. We are children of God and we can celebrate brotherhood everywhere we are. 